Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to be making concentrated ammonia. And I have a really easy way for you to do it. Okay, so all you're going to need for this is 45 grams of urea and 60 grams of sodium hydroxide. Okay, so first we're going to add about 100 milliliters of water to a 250 milliliter 2 nectron bottom flask. Then we're going to add 45 grams of urea. Then I'll add 60 grams of sodium hydroxide. And I definitely didn't spill it everywhere and cut out the part where I did. Anyways, the good thing about this reaction is it does not start producing ammonia until you heat it up. Now I didn't have a stir bar at the time so I just stirred it with this weird plastic thing I found lying on the ground. Now I'm going to connect a gas bubbler setup. This funnel prevents suckback and allows the ammonia gas to dissolve faster. And here's the overall setup. Now I'm going to turn on the heating. Now that the reaction is producing ammonia gas, it's going to start pushing out all the air. And you can see this here. Now as the reaction heats up, more and more ammonia will be liberated. And as you can see, when all the air is gone, the ammonia just starts dissolving. And as you can see, it's pulsating back and forth, which means more gas is getting there and it's just getting redissolved into solution. And this makes our ammonium hydroxide solution. Here's a time lapse of the reaction. Now, as the reaction comes to a finish, you can see the bubbles of ammonia gas die down. Now I'm going to turn off the heating. And here's my ammonia. Now I'm going to transfer it to a storage container. And now it's properly labeled. And as for the reaction flask, we're left with a cake of sodium carbonate and water. I'm sure this will be fun to clean. Okay, so thanks for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. And if you want more like this, make sure to like and subscribe. And it will be very nice of you guys if you pass some subscribers to my friend Firetrier.